Tim Allen just exposed something sick about Last Man Standing that will leave Hollywood liberals furious. Last Man Standing star Tim Allen just got on Norm MacDonald Live to talk about his show's controversial cancellation at ABC. At the time, Last Man Standing was ABC's second-highest rated show, and its cancellation came as a shock to both the cast and the show's fans, Fox News reports. Some viewers suggested the reason the popular show was so abruptly cancelled was that Tim Allen leaned conservative in some of his character's dialogue, I know, heaven forbid there's anything on TV that isn't left. Although ABC has denied those allegations, Allen himself claimed his conservatism was the reason and said so again during the interview. I always wanted Last Man Standing to be like, all in the families, Archie Bunker. Archie Bunker pushed boundaries, but Carol O'Connor was not that guy at all. I am a version of that guy. But there is nothing more dangerous, especially in this climate, than a funny, likable conservative character. He is mitigated on the show by a family of women who had a difference of opinions, but he was a likable guy and a principled guy about work and ethics and all this stuff, I think. Check out the full interview here. Last Man Standing is in syndication now. That's about where it's going to be, and it'll be then and then they'll... You, uh, will it come back? There was talk of going to CMT. Uh, it would, <laughs> it, you couldn't have handled this worse. Yeah. Not for me, because I'll survive, but there's 190 of us that worked there that didn't... Yeah, that's that true. They didn't I let them know until that. late June. Yeah, which yeah. They, it was handled very badly. To me, it was handled yeah, badly. Yeah. You don't think and it was getting right. great, you know, it was getting great ratings. Yeah, it's their yeah. second biggest show. Why yeah. do I haven't haven't won a Friday night in 15 years? Friday night. Wow. Yeah. They put us out to pasture on Friday. We won Friday. Big night for us. Big night for them. I would have put Roseanne after. Win Friday. I would have put Roseanne after us. Yeah. That's what I would have done. Just launch Roseanne. Mm -hmm. Launch any show you want. Use us just yeah. to launch shows. Yeah. yeah. If nothing else. Yeah. It's hard. It. I. I have no idea why they. Why they did. What well, they you did. know, it, years and years ago, when, when I was young, they had the Beverly Hillbillies and Green Acres, and they canceled all the, even though they were the top ten shows, because William Paley and uh, and his uh, friends in the Upper West Side thought. To have rural comedies were embarrassing. You know what I mean, and I, I think that may be. Uh, I, you know what, what I, you're what, I, I always th wanted LMS Last Man Standing to be like Archie Bunker. Archie Bunker pushed boundaries. That, it was like that. He, he pushed boundaries. And Carol Connor was not that guy at all. Oh, and I'm, I'm a version of that guy. Yeah. But I like. I said there's nothing more dangerous to me, especially in this climate, than a funny, uh, likable conservative. That was the most dangerous thing that, because he was mitigated on the show by a family of all women that ha had different opinions. Yeah. But the guy was a likable guy and really was a principled guy, just about yeah. work and ethics and all this stuff. I think there's nothing more dangerous right now than a likable conservative character. Well, uh, uh, Archie Bunker to me was by far the most likable. I, exactly. The more he had was a really yeah. Unlikable. The more angry he got, the the better he was. Right. And, I say, and also the funny guy the funny, is the guy you're going to go to. Right, yeah, right. right. Last Man Standing was an awesome show that so many Americans loved and related to. It's too bad that it got kicked off the air. Did you watch it? Do you think Tim Allen's right? Share it out, patriots.